is gonna be a short nostalgia video from 20, 2021 October. I'm gonna be talking about the emails that I had previously in the past. I wanna start with the first email that I came from Cuba, which it was Yahoo. Yahoo was very popular back then. It had many features like Yahoo Messenger. It looked like this, uh, the little sleeping face. And then when you logged in, it will turn into a smiley face. A lot of people like Yahoo. Uh, you could play uh, games with your friends. You could also have a lot of um, emojis and GIFs that you will send directly through the messenger. It looked like that on the phone. Then after that, uh, um, Hotmail started doing the same thing. They came up with their own uh, messenger. I looked like that, the same thing. You had games, you could do plugins, uh, you would send whatever you wanted to your friends. You could also have your own profile right there, a little, you know, anime, cartoon looking profile. Uh, so you see here, Yahoo, Hotmail, and AOL, they all started doing the same thing, which was integrating Messenger directly to the email. Uh, this was a trend. Uh, the, the training at the moment, I I had Hotmail and Yahoo. I never tried AOL. That one is kind of far back for me. Uh, but again, the winner here would have, for me at least, has been Gmail. Uh, I tried Gmail the first time when I went to FIU. They give you an F uh, FIU dot edu account. It's just basically a Gmail account. And um, ever since I've been using Gmail, it's great. Uh, it's compatible with most websites that you go to. They let you log in just by having a Gmail account. When you have a Gmail account, you can log in into Google Chrome, Google Maps. It will store all of your uh, functions and all of your settings for you. Uh, it's free. All of these uh, emails are free. And I'm going to attach a video of how by the years how these uh, email providers you know they competed with each other until of course gmail came on top i think after 2012 gmail has been the number one email provider